Three, two, one. Hey, welcome back. Okay, so it's me and Justin today, <clears throat> and we're going to be playing Marvel Nemesis Rise of the Imperfects. Well, you're going to be playing. Oh, I'll, be gonna, play. I'll, I'll be I'll be I've never played this game before. Oh, it's, a, it's, it's a great game. Um, I remember playing this a lot with my brother growing up. Yes, we want to oh, save. But it's a game that I really wish took off, but I never really did. But, like, you, you got sections where you play as different heroes from mm -hmm. different... So, like, you have the Thing, you have, I think, the F Human Torch is in it, uh, Iron Man. Like, all the, again, all the big names are in this. I was going to say, I saw a Daredevil in mm -hmm. um, part of the trailer, Spider-Man's on the cover. <laughs> and shit just got real already. Look at this. It's so it's such a dark like it's such a dark game. For Marvel it is. It's really dark. Well, I'm not even talking like content, I'm talking just graphically. It's dark. Oh yeah. Like it's yeah. difficult to see some things. Yeah, it is. But look at it. Like it's it's got that stereotypical like like it looks like a uh, a GameCube game. No, these I don't know what these things are supposed to be. They look like Barack. Baraka. Aliens? They're supposed to be aliens. I, where did he go? He jumped. Oh. What? Oh shit. Pick up cars. I don't actually know where am I supposed to go? Oh. Yeah, so I think this is actually one of the fighting stuff. Stop it, you asshole. Oh, they're invaders. Yeah, alien. There were ships flying. I yeah, figured they were aliens. Dude, it's Marvel. You never know what they are. But they're aliens. Oh, I can't get up there. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Where Where does... Because I, I, I came from over here. Yes. I, I think you can get up there. You just weren't jumping in the right angle. Probably. Can I, can I grab him? Can I... Go... Uh. Oh. <laughs> it was such a gentle toss. It's such a big. I don't think he's in. dead yet. No, that's why you can't get up there yet. I saw him poof. So poof, not Want him. Ah, oh, there he is. Oh, this is a different one. So I don't know if they, they might have gotten Michael Chiklis to do the voice of uh, the thing in this. Oh, dude, hmm. something open. Yes, I can go over here now. And I think, like, if I don't, if I recall correctly, a couple of uh, heroes get possessed in this too. Okay. By these aliens. So like Storm and other. Where am I going? You have to jump back up there. Where? Go to the go to the right. Like, there. yep. Oh, I had to go back on the other side of the bridge. Yep. Wall. Oh. They have to go through there. And cutscene. Yeah, really, really original. You know, characters here. Oh shit! Oh, I thought he was gonna catch that. Let's throw it back. It is indeed clobbering time. I don't think it's Michael Shirkless though. It didn't huh? sound like him. His voice was too dark, like too deep. Yeah, I don't even. I didn't even hit him. He just flew back. You hit him with the car. Did I hit him? With the yeah. Him. Yeah. There we go. So I mean, oh, oh victory, cool. Okay. This does like play like Mortal Kombat a little bit. I, with the, I can kind of see it. With the abrupt cutscenes. And it's, well, the only difference would be that it's not like the streamlined fighting of there's not a whole lot of movement in the maps besides Mortal Kombat 10. Uh, that's true. Well, like, I mean. With Mortal Kombat 10, there's a lot more um, movement in the game itself. Like, you can jump left and right. 
Yeah, that's true. That's true. And I mean, you can go to different portions of the maps. They were able to do that in uh, Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe. Yeah, uh, which but, I mean, we didn't. We're, we're not supposed to talk about that game because it was a. It was like a hey, there's Cap. Yeah, there goes Cap. Yeah, they abducted him right away. They go after the good heroes first. Punisher. I feel like no one would be able to capture the Punisher. Or the Hulk. Yeah. Well, they didn't really capture the Hulk. They, they just, just knocked him unconscious. Yeah, they, they one hit, dude. The only person I the only person I know who can do that is Spider Man. Spider Man's knocked out uh, the Hulk of him in. Uh, he's one shot him before. Is that Wolverine? Yes. Wolverine has dreadlocks. <laughs> I don't think it's dreadlocks. I just think it's bad graphics. He looks like he is really. It's those cube graphics back from 2005. What movie was around 2005? It would have been like X2, wouldn't it? Spider-Man 1? Mm, I don't remember. Something had uh, Daredevil? No, I think Daredevil happened before that. That might have been 2003. But something had to have come out around this in order to make this game. Because, like, again, no, no characters actually came from... <clears throat> Oh, get a pick. Uh, I'm gonna play. Yeah, Daredevil. Fun. The movie came out in 2003. And I'm looking up X Men. Because I think X Men was X Men was the first one. X Men was 2000. X Men was 2000. X Two was 2003, and Last Stand was 2006. So this must have been right before Last Stand. Oh my God! Look at the. Do I not have claws? He's having you taking him out yet? I don't know. I don't I don't know. Where are my claws? Oh, there they are. Ugh. I think I can climb up walls in this too. Ah. Okay. Nope. Not yet. I can do the triangle jump. I like, oh, with, with, shit. I like how with Wolverine it's just called street fighting. Pretty, well, I mean, that's what you're doing. You're just fighting in the street. Can you get cars? Nope. <laughs> I like how they still do the animation. Oh, now you have your hell yeah. I think every character gets that rage point. But they do just obnoxious amounts of damage. Well, I mean, Wolverine actually does have... He does He does have his Berserker mode. mode. Yeah. Thanks to the uh, Weapon X program. Oh. Okay, <laughs> just did the splits there. That's cool. God. So many enemies. This game is just button mashing, isn't it? Yeah, at a certain point. Yeah, there's not there's not really any combos. I mean, you can do you can do throws. Uh, you can just take punches. You can do that when you're trying to figure out how to do throws. I mean, with the thing, I think I hit Y and he did he threw. And then you could get lost looking for the uh, the progression. Oh, super jump apparently. Oh. Um, just, just teleport. Okay. Just teleport. I did just teleport. <laughs> what is this? I lo like, again, I play I haven't played this in probably ten years. So, I don't know. Jake would have been seven? I have no idea. Yeah, Jake would have been seven when I didn't play this. So. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's got the decapitator. Yep. Doing much decapitating. No. You get more or less decapitated. Well, I mean, can you really decapitate a uh, Wolverine if you don't have an adamantium weapon? That's true. There was a. He lost the fight against a. Uh, yeah, what's his name? From Metal Gear Solid Five. Snake. Not Snake. The other guy. Raiden. 
Oh Raiden. yeah, with he the, lost with that the, fight against the death battle with the death battle. Yeah, well, I mean that's a good place to leave off for this episode. So we'll pick it up in the next episode. So like, comment, subscribe, uh, like this video if you want more of it. Uh, we're gonna do a couple of episodes right now, back to back, just to see, you know, just to put some stuff out for right now. So uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next episode.